Hey man, what's good YouTube? Hey, welcome to my channel though. It's like, it's crazy to me because I've been saying I was gonna do YouTube for like so long. I wanted to do it when I was younger, but the only problem is like, I ain't had the equipment. Now I got like a like, kind of a starter equipment though. It's finna get better, you know what I'm saying? I'm finna like really put my all into this. I'm finna take it seriously. I got like nothing else to like lose. So like, I might as well just take it serious. Hey though, you know what I'm saying? As you can tell by the title of the video, we finna be doing a sneaker collection. Now I got like a lot of shoes. I probably got like 50, 60 something. And I'm only 15, so don't be expecting like some $10,000 Dior suits. I got like some suits that cost a lot. Don't be expecting like no serious $10,000 Dior suits. That's crazy. I would never spend that money on suits, so don't be expecting them. But like, I got like a lot of suits. I also got slides back there, so that's probably like 70 something. I got a lot. But yeah, though, we finna be doing this thing collection. Hey, if you like the video, you know what I'm saying? Make sure to hit that like button. Make sure to hit that subscribe button. Make sure to turn on the post notification. I'm finna post a lot more. Don't be expecting like a one time thing. We finna post a lot more. Hey though, we finna be on this little road to thousand subscribers or whatever. We finna be going crazy though. I'm finna take it serious. I'm finna, bro, hey, if you watching this, I'm finna take you too serious. I'm like, I'm so serious. But hey, um, I'm finna get into the video. Why not? For the first two, we got these pattern bridge wooden ones right here. I'm finna go in order of one through 13. That's the highest number I got. But yeah, these right here, these are reps for the ones who don't know. I personally do not care. They're still hard to me. But you know what I'm saying? I did the double lacing. In my opinion, this go hard. I like these shoes. I like these shoes a lot. I don't really wear Jordan ones because they look weird on my feet. But yeah, I think these shoes is hard though. For sure. I don't have no Jordan twos or threes, but I do have three pair of Jordan fours. These right here in the UNC fours. I love these shoes a lot. I actually think these shoes go very hard. The only problem is like I don't have anything to match this color, so I don't really be wearing them too much. But they go hard for sure. Next up, we got a Jordan four. I think Air Max ninety five or something like that. I could be wrong. But I just wore these suits recently, like a week ago, actually. I wore it the first week of school, I think. These suits go hard, though. I think they're very slept on. Nobody really be talking about these, bro. These really go hard, bro, I swear. We got a Jordan 4 Bears right here. This is actually one of the very few suits I actually managed to get for retail. Like, the price went up very high for these. I actually bought these when I was in sixth grade. I wanted them so bad when they first came out, but I didn't wear them because I couldn't really fit them. As you can tell from the bottoms, I didn't wear them. I only wore them, like, one time. But like, honestly, these is very hard. I need to wear these more. But like, price went up crazy. Nobody really wanted them at first, but like, not, I mean, people wanted them, but they didn't want them like how they want them now. Like the TikTok trends went up or whatever, but these go hard for sure. I need to wear these more though. Next up, we got the Black Cat Force right here. These are replicas for the ones who do care about that stuff. But like, I actually love these too. I'll still be wearing them. Cause like, they go so hard. Like they all black go everything. $900 though for like a real pair is crazy to me. Like all black shoes, $900. That's a little crazy, but hey, I got these for free from a TikTok video, so. Next up, we got the Jordan 5, Blue Suede 5s. I believe that's the name. I had the red pair, actually, when I was in fifth grade, I think. I wore them to the death. Like, they're, they're gone. I threw them away. I wore them to the death, bro. But I do have the blue pair here. As you can tell from the bottoms, I wore these a lot, too. I actually love these shoes, bro. These is these are so people really don't know about these. I got the Green Bean 5s right here. These just recently, like, re-released. I actually wanted them before they even, like, re-released. But uh, everybody got them though, that's the bad part. Everybody got these shoes, but I'm gonna still wear them eventually. I need to relace them, like and actually do the lace lock. I haven't did it yet, but yeah, these shoes are. Next up, we got the Jordan 5 with the fives right here. I need to wear these more, cause like, as you can tell, I'll barely be wearing them, but these shoes go so hard. I actually bought these early access on sneakers cause I got the notification. I wanted them like so bad, cause it's like, you barely see people wearing like making nice shoes or even like making them. Cause like people be scared to make them, but they go hard though. I love these shoes. Next up, we got the electric green sixes right here. These shoes go so hard. I actually love these. I just recently uh, wore them like two weeks ago. The first week of school, I want, want to say I wore them third day maybe. But yeah, these shoes go hard. I actually tried for the infrared sixes, I want to say like three years ago. I wanted them so bad, but I couldn't get them because they sold out. So, you know what I'm saying? The black and green go so hard. So it's kind of similar to the black and red. So I just bought these when they came out. I had to get them. Next up, we got the Citrus 7s right here. And now I actually love these shoes, but people hate on them crazy though. I really don't know why, but they were literally sitting when I bought them. Like I bought them, I want to say like three weeks ago. I bought them literally the next day. Like that's how you know they were sitting. So like I just went in the store and just bought them early in the morning too though. But yeah, I got to wear these though. I haven't worn them yet. I got the Laker 9s right here or a Kobe Bryant 9s right here. Uh, These shoes, these gone. I ain't gonna lie, I need to throw them away. Like they're gone. This is my second time ever having them. The first pair I had actually, I actually grew out of them fast, but I think I ended up losing that pair because I don't have them no more. But yeah, I might have to throw these away. You can tell like they gone, bro. I got the snakeskin 11 lows, the pink version, but 
I really don't wear these shoes, honestly. Like, I don't know, it's just something about the white, I guess. I really don't wear white a lot, but I mean, they hard, but I just don't be wearing them, though. Next up, we got Jordan 12s. I have a, like, I want to say, I think I have five pairs of Jordan 12s. I have a lot. I had more, though. I had like eight, but I sold like three of them because I just wasn't wearing them, but. These are the University Gold 12s. I need to wear these more too. I really don't be wearing shoes a lot because I got so many slides back there, bro. But yeah, these shoes go hard. I love these shoes for sure. This right here is the Flu Gang 12s. Now, I actually love these shoes. Like, I, bro, I love these shoes, bro. The black and red just go too hard. Like, this is probably like one of the best joints to ever release, in my opinion, bro. Like, I love these shoes. I need to start wearing them recently because, like, I stopped wearing them for a reason, but. Yeah, these need to come out again because they too hard, bro, I swear. Next up, we got the Game Royal 12s right here. Now, these shoes look so good to me. Like, I just like the black the, and the blue. You can tell, like, the pattern, the red, the blue, and the gold. But, yeah, I just like all three of them. Next up, we got the Gray and White 12. Now, these are not the new version that just recently came out. These are, like, the old version. It came out, like, I want to say, like, three years ago, too. Around Christmas time, I remember that. But I don't really be wearing them because they're, like, a half size down. But I might sell them. I don't know, but... Yeah, next up we got the Blackhead 13s. Now, a crazy story behind these is I actually got sent the wrong pair of shoes. So I bought them from a store in Tennessee, right? And they were supposed to send me the Chris Paul 13s and a whole nother size. But they ended up shipping me these and now I can actually wear them. So I'm not really mad. I never filed a complaint because I think I like these more than the Chris Paul 13s. We got the Hyper World 13s right here. I actually like, I really don't know why I bought them because I already got the blue and black 12s, but I don't know if I'm going to sell them. I think I'm going to just keep them just because. But yeah, I like these shoes a lot, though. Next up, we got the Olive 13s. Now, these shoes, like, I don't know if I even really... I actually love the color. I just don't be wearing them. I think it's just the brown. They're not bad, but, like, I don't know if I'm going to keep them. Moving on to the Yeezy section. I got these, uh, I think these Inflame Orange slides right here. I don't really be wearing them because I got the black pair, but yeah, these go hard. I got them actually retail from JD Sports the day they dropped. So yeah, this is the black pair I was talking about. For some reason, these are like 10 times more comfier than the orange pair. Like I'll be wearing these all the time, bro. You kind of, oh, you really can't tell from the bottoms because I'll be cleaning them. But like, I'll be wearing these so much. I promise you, bro. Like I really don't be wearing suits. I got these. I got these foam runners right here. I want to say they're um the MX Brown, something like that. Clay Brown or something. I really don't know, but. I actually love these foam runners right here. I haven't worn these in a long time. I need to pull them back out, but I used to wear these a lot my freshman year. So yeah, these right here are the Blush 500s right here. I don't be wearing them because I got the brown pair. They cool, I guess, but I don't really find them like good. I, I might get rid of them. I don't know. They cool, I guess, but yeah, they nothing special. This is the brown pair I was mentioning. These shoes just go 10 times harder. I just like the color of the brown better than the white. So yeah, I, I actually wore these, I'm going to say like Frederick School too. I wore them uh, with like a brown shirt. It's on my TikTok, but yeah, these shoes go too hard. These right here are the UD 700 Suns. I actually love these shoes because like the bright orange, the yellow, it just go too hard. I just need to wear these more. I wore them only thing one time. I want to say, yeah, I want to say one time, but yeah. They go hard though, for sure. These are the UD 700s MXVN. I think the color is like just silver. I have no idea. It's either silver or gray. They go hard though. I actually have my wore these. I need to wear them. They had, I got these like a year ago and I haven't worn them. So that's kind of crazy, but I'm going to pull them out this year probably. I need to wear these. Next up, we got these Goldenrod Dunks. I haven't even worn these. I bought them like eight months ago. Honestly, I don't know if it's just a color. I just really don't like these shoes. I don't know where I... I think I bought them just to say like I have a pair of Dunks. But like now that I got them, I'm going to wear them eventually though. But yeah, the height kind of fell off for me. These right here are Supreme SB Dunks. Now I do have four pair of replica Dunks. No, I did not pay like, no, I did not pay for anything. I just got them for free. So yeah, I do have these. These are the one, one of the four, but yeah, I do have these green Supreme Dunks. The next pair I have is the yellow Grateful Dead Dunks. Now I actually love these shoes. Like I, these shoes, bro, if I told you these are real, bro, that, that's how good they look in person. Like these look, if I told you that was real, you would think they were real, bro. Like they look 10 out of 10. I don't see nothing wrong with them, but yeah, I love these shoes. These right here are the Strange Club SB Dunks. Now these, if you looked in person, you could probably tell that it's fake. Cause I could tell they was fake a little. Like I see the flaws. You can see the, you can see the flaws if you can. T if you like, if you know, you know. You can see the flaws. But, um, they still look hard though. It came with a like special box and everything. But yeah, they go hard for sure. Like see the inside so They go hard. Now these right here are the Purple Lobster Dunks. Now these is probably top three of my favorite shoes even though they're reps but i just love like the color purple that's my favorite color for the ones who don't know but 
like the inside this is hard like you can't even tell these is fake i haven't worn these but you can't tell they're fake at all like these look so good bro these right here are some balenciaga track runners now these are probably the most uncomfortable suit i ever wore tied with the jordan ones like i when i was wearing them bro i was like i'd take them off i wore them for literally probably about an hour maybe 30 minutes like that's how bad they hurt it's why i'm not into designer suits but i mean they look good on feed so this is another pair of foam pods right here. These are actually the gold and black version. I like these way more just cause the gold, I don't have gold shoes, like this type of gold. So yeah, I mean, I really love these shoes. I haven't worn them since seventh grade, I think. I'm gonna pull them out soon though, for sure. These right here are white Gucci foam pods. Now I haven't worn them since like sixth grade. That's really when I bought them, but I mean, they look cool. I just don't really wear foam pods. They're like bulky on my feet, so yeah. These right here are some red Uggs. Now, I love the red color. Like, that's really the reason why I bought them. But you really got to wear these in the winter time. So, I actually haven't wore these. You can tell from the bottoms. But I'm going to pull them out soon for sure. These right here is Black Forces. Now, I bought these and I haven't wore these at all. But I think what I'm going to do is I'm going to make these have rope laces. Like, customize them and everything. I have customized two before. That was a long time. I'm going to show that suit soon in the video. But... Yeah, I love these shoes. I need to, I need to customize them soon though. These right here are some Air Max 720s. I honestly forgot the name. Probably like C Green. I think that was the name, but I love it. I love how it's like mixed straight. I've never seen it on a shoe, so yeah, it's nothing special about these though. These right here are some Air Max 720 React. Now, I actually wanted these before they even came out, but they were going for like 180 and I just wasn't trying to buy that for like some Air Maxes that I knew were going to go and sell, but I actually walked into a mall. Like, I walked into a mall entrance that has a Ross in it. If you live in Texas, you probably know what I'm talking about. But yeah, I walked in and literally went to the Ross and I saw the shoes sitting there. So I bought them. This is some random Puma shoe I bought for like $60. I don't even know why I bought them, honestly, but they look hard. I like the color. That's what I really like, but I don't have anything really Puma in my closet besides this. So yeah, these shoes are some Air Forces I actually customized in seventh grade, literally with Sharpie. One time, like, I didn't even draw it out with pencil or nothing. To be honest, they actually look hard in my opinion. I'm finna do another custom pair of Air Forces. Cause I just love how these suits look. I don't wear them, but I need to do another pair of custom Air Force. I went crazy on these, I'm low key. Believe it or not, this is actually one of my favorite pair of shoes. Like these shoes literally carried my whole sixth grade year. I wore them pretty much every day cause we couldn't wear slots. But I love these shoes, bro. Red Hirachis, I don't care. People gonna talk about them. They look hard, I don't care. I love these shoes. I don't wear them no more, but yeah i need to buy a new pair probably these are like some air max plus right here you could sell uh, i think it's right here yeah i literally scraped these in the parking lot and i haven't worn them since i don't know why but i don't even know how i did it i just remember seeing they were scraped when i got home these shoes are honestly really irrelevant but i'm showing them anyway these are some random pair of ultra boosts i think it's like the lego because it's like it feels like a lego right here but yeah, I mean, they cool, I guess. This, once again, is another relevant shoe, but I'm sewing them anyway. Just regular pair of black checker vans. I don't wear them. I don't I don't even know I have these, honestly, but they're not bad, I guess. These right here are the Kobe 5 5 rings, I believe. I bought these before the price went up. If you follow me on TikTok, you know where this suit came from. But yeah, I just recently posted a video about these, but these shoes go hard, though, for sure. These right here are the Zoom Freak ones. Now, I don't play basketball no more just because it's just not fun to me, like, you know what I'm saying? I moved on to like different passions. But like, I actually love these shoes. I love the different coloring. That's really why I bought them. I actually bought these early. I walked in the mall and they was not even supposed to be out yet. But uh, the guy sold them to me, so I just bought them. These right here are some Kyrie Sixes. Oracle Aqua, I think that's the name. I don't know why I remember that, but I know that's the name. I think these are the Sixes. Because he makes so many shoes that look the same now. I really don't know. But yeah, these go hard for sure. These right here are some Vapor Max 2019. Now, when I wore these shoes, for some reason, like so many people are asking me where I got them from. But I wore them, the last time I wore them was probably seventh grade. That's when I bought them. But yeah, I love these. I bought them literally for a seventh grade school year. And I wore them pretty much a lot at that time. These right here are the Harden for All American game. My like, something like that. It's something similar to that, but I actually switched the laces in. The other pair has purple, and this one has orange. They came with black though. But yeah, I love the purple. It's my favorite color, like I said. Next up, we got the Gucci slides right here. These shoes actually go so hard, but the like quality, bro, like they scraped right there so easily. I wore them one time on a plane and they literally scraped. So I just kept on wearing them because I was like, I don't even care no more. But yeah. Next up, we got the Kappa slides right here. Now these are actually one of my like favorite slides ever. I think these honestly might be my favorite just because I love these like 
almost as much as my black Yeezys. Like these go hard. I got three pair of these. This is another pair of Calvin Slots. I don't wear these cause I really don't wear white, but I mean, they, they cool. They just not my favorite. These the least probably out of three. This is my last pair of Calvin Slots. Now I wear these literally every day of my freshman year, bro. Like my routine was like waking up 7.30, take a quick shower, brush my teeth, put on some clothes, bro. Random clothes, I don't even care. And just throw these on. That's what I was wearing every day pretty much. Like these got me through a lot, I ain't gonna lie. I actually lied, it's not my last pair of Capital Slots. These are my last pair of Capital Slots. They're just different. Like those are the sandal version and these are the slide version. These go hard too though. You would probably think that it's some designer shoes like if I was walking around with them. We got the purple Crocs right here. And I actually love these Crocs. I don't be wearing Crocs though, but like, I love the color purple once again. It's my favorite color. These, they go hard, I can't lie. We got the tie-dye Crocs right here. Now I don't be wearing these. I do not be wearing these no more. I don't know, bro. Like, some people gonna say, like, ta -da -cro I mean, it, it don't look bad, bro, but it's just not me, bro. It's just not me. My last pair of slides, and to wrap up the collection, is these bubble slides. Now, I actually love these slides so much. I don't be wearing them, like, as much as my other slides, but I love these, bro. Like, they just go hard, and they comfortable, too. Hey, man, I appreciate any of everybody who watched this video. Uh, it don't matter if you skip through it. If you watch that full video, I appreciate you, man. It don't matter, bro. As long as you watch this video, hey, make sure to hit that like button. Make sure to hit that subscribe button. We finna drop more videos. And also, you know what I'm saying? Feel free to drop advice in the comments because all this editing, recording and stuff like that, I'm doing is literally like by myself. You know what I'm saying? Kind of learning. I'm still learning. I'm going to get better for sure. You know what I'm saying? Just Y'all going to see, bro. We want to roll to 1K, man. Hey, uh, make sure you hit that subscribe button. Make sure you hit that like button. Make sure you turn on post notifications for sure. Cause we finna drop more videos for sure. And yeah, man, we out. What I mean, then you won't even eat. Let's get that understood. You don't wanna see me out in traffic, which is automatic. I'm the type of nigga leave you worry without an answer.